Hi, I'm Nisi Westmoreland and I teach fourth grade and I've really been enjoying using the Makey Makey with my students and I wanted to tell you a little bit about it today. So this is a Makey Makey and it is named such because you can make anything into a key. And when you plug it into your computer, it's going to act like a keyboard. And now normally your keyboard works by when you press a key, there's a series of circuits within your, well, underneath your keyboard and it makes connections to complete the circuit to press that key. It tells your computer which key you pressed. So when we plug in the Makey Makey, it's going to do basically the same thing. And you can see actually that even though I've got the Makey Makey plugged in, you can still use all of your normal keyboard keys. In this case, the um, arrow keys will make the piano sounds. And so I'm gonna use my Makey Makey to do the same thing. It's way more fun because we can use whatever we want to make those connections instead of just the tiny wires within the keyboard. So um, we currently have uh, our power source being the battery of the laptop and electricity is flowing into the Makey Makey and it's going to need to complete a circuit, a circle um, for that electricity to travel through a complete path. So we're going to use the left arrow key and um, if I want to make that, that connection and tell the computer I want to press that key, I can connect it even just with my fingers right now with the left arrow key and then connect it back to the earth or ground. So the electricity will travel through my body and back to the power source, the computer. So it knows I touched the left arrow key. Same with all the other keys. Um, so that's basically what you do. All right, so... To make this a little bit more fun, I'm going to connect this left arrow key to my carrot, which conducts because it's basically full of water. And the electricity is traveling from my power source down the cord into the makey makey, down this cord, and into my carrot. But we haven't completed the circuit. It's going to need to get back, back to earth, so I need a ground cable or earth cable, same thing. Um, and I'll connect the yellow one there. And so I'm going to hold the alligator clip of the ground. So I'm using my body as the switch right now to complete the circuit or disconnect the circuit and press that key. So whenever I use my body, complete the circuit, touch the carrot, I've done it. So you can use anything you want that conducts to connect to the Makey Makey, be as creative as you want. Play-Doh works well, fruits work well because they're Play-Doh fruit basically made of water. Water works well. Um, I keep on hand a lot of copper tape and just bell wire, aluminum foil. All of these things work great. It's actually really great too when your students um, try to connect something that doesn't con conduct. We found out the other day marshmallows don't conduct, but it was a great learning experience for my kids. So have fun with your Makey Makey.